In this video, we'll balance the net ionic equation for FeCO3 plus H2SO4. This is iron 2 carbonate. This is sulfuric acid. So the first thing we'll do is balance the molecular equation. This is our molecular equation. It's already balanced, so that's kind of nice. Next, we'll write the state for each substance. So if you know your solubility rules, carbonates in general are insoluble. So our iron 2 carbonate here, that's going to be a solid. Sulfuric acid is a strong acid, so it's a strong acid. It's going to dissociate completely. We're going to put AQ after that. Iron 2 sulfate, in general, sulfates are soluble. And iron 2 sulfate, that's soluble, so we're going to put an AQ after that. Water, that is a liquid. And then carbon dioxide, that's a gas. So we have our states. Now we can split the strong electrolytes into their ions for the complete ionic equation. That'll look like this. So this is the complete ionic equation for FeCO3 plus H2SO4. Now we'll cross out spectator ions. They're on both sides of the complete ionic equation. So as we look across here, we have our reactants and then on the bottom our products. This sulfate ion, that's the only thing that's the same on both sides. So the sulfate ion, those are the spectator ions. We cross those out. What's left is the net ionic equation for iron 2 carbonate plus sulfuric acid. I'll clean this up and add the states in. We'll have our net ionic equation. So this is the balanced net ionic equation for this iron 2 carbonate and sulfuric acid. You'll note that charge is conserved. We have 2 times 1 plus, so 2 plus in the reactants. And then in the products here, we have the 2 plus. If you count the atoms up, they're balanced as well. This is Dr. B with the balanced net ionic equation for FeCO3 plus H2SO4. Thanks for watching.